Good morning, greetings and salutations, you guys. It's Hayden here. Welcome to another episode of um, the vlog. Today, we're gonna go run some errands with mom. We're gonna head over to, where is it called? To LBC, we're gonna send something um, to the Philippines. And then we're also going to go to the Pottery Barn Outlet. Ah! I'm currently in the Suburban. Uh, I just backed it up to the house because I'm gonna take out the back row of seats. <laughs> Alright you guys, we just got to LBC. I'm parked here in the parking lot waiting for mom. They only allow like one or two people into the um, into the store at once, so, um, or like the office or whatever. So I didn't want to like take up any space, I'm just like waiting for mom. Um, and then after, I don't know, I'm trying to decide if I want to get something to eat or if like we should just wait until lunch or like till after we pick up the table because from here, we're gonna head over to the Pottery Barn outlet, and then we're gonna look around a little bit, pick up the table, bring that home, and then, yeah. Also, the kids are all half-dated this week. Well, not not all of them, just um, Zach and Elizo. They're half-day the whole week because I think they're doing, um, I think it's like parent-teacher conferences. And then Cade is half-days on Monday, so all the kids are half-day today, so gonna be it's gonna be an early day for everyone oh but the kids do have um water polo practice gosh their schedules are like so busy it's just like so hectic but it's yeah it's fun things are like, kind of going back to normal so it's like good the kids love going to school and they love water polo practice so much it's like their favorite so i'm really glad that they enjoy it uh but that's the update for right now i'll see you guys again when we head over to the pottery barn outlet all right, you guys, Pottery Barn! Here's mom. Are you excited? This yeah. ship is so much cuter than the ship that we have that's not a pirate ship. I know. Oh, the Harry Potter trunk, that's so cute. Oh, I the like bird. this. Oh, this is so cool. I know. How much is this, mom? $89.50. Is there an extra discount today? 50% off? It's better than that everything Mom, look at these leaves. A leaf platter. Whoa. So cute. Ooh, look at this. This is nice. I like it. I feel like I haven't been in a pottery barn forever, so I like want everything. Let's look at all the sofas, because all the sofas look fantastic. Or all the chairs. Wow. Did you look at all the pillows already? Oh, the bedding is so nice, Mom. Oh, that's pretty with the flowers. Oh. Is that a duvet cover? No, it's this duvet cover. Mm, that's pretty. We were just almost time for duvets because <laughs> it's gonna be cold. The hummingbird one's my favorite one so far. Yeah. The outdoor chairs, mom. Is this like your? Is this like the chair, the table that you guys got? Ooh, what's that? Hybrid memory. Ooh, cool touch. That's my fave. How much is that? Uh, I don't think I saw a sticker. Oh no, I didn't see a sticker. Oh no, a hundred dollars. That's actually extra forty, so that's sixty bucks a pillow. Do you see this? This is so cute. Oh, mom. The octopus, like, little condiment thing. Yeah. It's so cute, too. It's so cute. Yeah, that seashell thing is really yeah. cute. Mom, I like this. It's so modern. That's amazing. Oh, this is the white version of what we have. 
kind of yeah. behind the sofa. Except this has drawers. Oh. Okay, mom. Oh, this is like sale bedding. Oh, how cute. Sunrise comforter. Extra large twin. It's 98. But. All right, mom and I are going through everything. Going through pillows. I found this Mongolian pillow. Like Mongolian fur pillow. We're gonna get this blanket. There's other one. How much is this one? All this stuff is an extra 70% off, guys. So this is 130. This is like Jersey feeling, I think. All right, this is what we have. I'll show you guys later exactly, but we got a good stack of stuff that we found. I love this sofa. I wish we could swap out our sofa for this one that we have because it has like the loungy part that sticks out. So cool. Look at all these great chairs, you guys. So many great things. All right, now I'm just looking through what else I can find here. So you have a bunch of like, oh, I have this. But this is, I have this as a desk. But this is a coffee table. That's cool. Oh, I love coffee tables so much. Like I wish I could get them all. <laughs> Oh my gosh, why do I have a weird obsession with coffee tables? It's like so strange. How cool is this? Like that looks like such a cool piece. Oh man. This is cute too. I have a bunch of lighting right now too. Which is crazy. Because before they never used to have too much lighting. But you can um, look up the names right here. And then you can just Google them. And they'll come up. Um, sometimes the boxes will have photos like that and sometimes things are open box like that so you can just see them right away see like photo photo more photos but I guess that's all of the coffee tables that they have Ooh, this one's chic I like that with the glass and the marble also this double glass one is cool too. The dining chairs, there's so, so many. Why do I love this little cabinet? This is cool. $6.98, extra 40% off. That's cute for the bathroom. Downstairs, no, I think this is too big. You'd have to measure it. No, it's nothing, it's too big. If it's only like... No, but the space is kind of wide downstairs in the bathroom. You, I think you really have to measure it because it might fit. What is this? Okay. Oh, another one. Mm -hmm. This one's smaller. I think it's a smaller one. Yeah. I like this one though. We're gonna have to measure that space and then come back. Do they have the name of this? Huh? I'm so obsessed with this. Also, we were looking at this for the bathroom downstairs, but I have to measure it to see if it'll fit because it might be a little too big. But I really like this little table. It's so cute. It's actually a side table, apparently, or a bedside table. But I love that it's a cabinet. You can put bags in there. Guys, this is the table that mom and dad bought. It's it's nice. I like it. It is, it is nice. It's called the bench right table. It's actually the updated version of the table that we actually already have in the dining room right now. I love this carpet. I know. This looks so nice. Uh-huh. Alright you guys, we got a rug pad from our friend Francisco that works here and now we're looking this is such a cool like little serving thing I can just imagine putting sushi on here I really want to have sushi mom's testing out a new stool because I feel like we're gonna need new stools soon I like this nice and leathery you think it's gonna hurt? No, this is nice, Mom.
Hold on, I have to look at all of the things here oh, yeah. for like the kitchen and the all the possibilities of my Harry Potter crest tumblers. How cute. I want them to, I want the kids to have another Harry Potter birthday party because that was fun. Even though they don't want it, they want like a a Roblox birthday party or something. <laughs> I'm like, ugh. That's not fun. I know. Oh my gosh, this is cool too. It matches that thing over there, like the stand. I there used to be a table here that looked just like that. And it was so cool. And it cost like $8 million. It was so expensive. Uh, I have an outside chandelier, Mom. Who knows? Outside chandelier. Let's see. In deco chandelier. Oh, for the law. I like that one, the little daybed looking thing that doesn't have a back. That would be really cute too. But actually, I love this sofa right here. This sofa looks like I, I want to lace. I want to take a nap there. This one right here. No, this one, Mom. I love how big the... It's like a bed. Oh, this is the one that I like. I like this little ottoman thing right here. I like that it's like glass and loose sight. How much is it? I don't know. Look underneath. 129 But 40% off. Oh no, that's candles and candlesticks. Is that considered a candle holder? You can put candles on it. <laughs> it's cute, I like that. We found mom's candle, it has a V. It's frosted pine, and then we found her candle holder. Chic. <laughs> mom and I managed to do some damage at Pottery Barn. We're gonna do a little holly haul when we get home, but right now we're gonna go pick up uh, the table and then we got a rug pad too, so let's go get those right now. All right, you guys, I don't know if you can see, but he's inside. Doesn't really help. All right, let's, let's go to the house. Oh, Uncle Johnny got all the stuff in the car. All right, you guys, right now, Eliza, you guys, the are over here. We're going to take in the table. Woo! This is our new outdoor table, so you guys can eat outside. You want to eat outside? You do? We don't have a table anymore. Okay, oh my God. Wow! We're blending in this. You like eating table like that? Zoom the camera in so I'm just when that epic moment comes I'm just gonna go. Oh. Um, Uncle Kush, can you make, play dramatic music for this moment? When you edit it? Why is it why does it want me to show his knee? Why do you want why do you want to show Why do you want me to show his
got the table over here. It was a lot of work, but we did it. And now the kids are running around the backyard. All right, you guys, I'm leaving. I'm gonna go pick up Zach and Eliza from Water Polo. I'm dropping off Cade. My mom's already there. Um, but yeah, that's what's happening right now. All right, I got in the car. Oh, there's Cade. Hello, Katie Kins. Are you ready? All right, let's go. We just got inside the car. We switched cars with Grandma because this one has a car seat. You guys have a good practice today at water polo? Yes. Yeah? Are you guys cold? Yes. Are you ready to go home? Yes. All right, let's go. All right, for dinner, we're having a little shabu shabu right here. So delicious. We got the fixings on the side, all the stuff in the middle. The little kids over there are eating egg rolls. It's a delicious dinner. All right, you guys, we are back at the house. I'm really excited to share with you guys what we ended up getting from the Pottery Barn Outlet. There's a ton of stuff. Um, we got some bigger items, too, that I unfortunately can't show you because they're so big. Um, one of them is actually this carpet right behind me. Mom and Dad wanted a new carpet in their room. Their carpet is just a little too small. Like, when they first bought the carpet, they didn't have, like, a little coffee table thing, and it was perfect. But then they added a coffee table, and then it's just, like... The coffee table fits on the carpet, but it's like a little short. They just wanted something a little longer. Anyway, so got this carpet. I think it's really, really pretty. And then we also got a rug mat for underneath because this is a thinner carpet. So then when they step on the carpet, it'll be like nice and squishy and soft. So uh, excited about that, but not excited about moving all the furniture because it's going to be a mission to do it. Because last time when Don and I did it, we had to like lift the bed and it is so hard to like lift that bed you guys and to put a carpet like underneath it so we're gonna figure it out um i don't know if we're gonna do like a video for it but i'll definitely show you guys how it looks once we do that so this is the carpet um it's really really pretty it's kind of like this chevrony type of print um and blue and creams and it's really nice the other thing that we got you can see part of it behind me it's right there that is an extension leaf for the table we got an outdoor dining table i'm gonna like insert the photos if i remember but you guys saw that when i was bringing it in with john into the backyard it is a great outdoor dining table that i'm really excited about we're gonna be able to enjoy the outside and eat there um, on that table we had another table before we got rid of it and i don't know like it was a thrifted table that I got I refinished the top we used it a bunch but um I don't know for, for some reason as a family we never used that table to eat outside we only ever used it for like um, whenever we had parties or guests at the house and it was like kind of a weird table uh, as far as like seating I don't know like the legs were awkward and the outdoor chairs that I had never really I don't know it was weird so donated that now we have this table, which I'm really excited about. It's over here. I'll turn this around so you can see it. It is right there. So we got the table, we got the carpet. Let me show you guys um, what we got in the bags. So all the things, like when we were in the store, they had like a section where they had these giant cardboard boxes full of different like linens from pillowcases to blankets to duvets. So many things. Everything was an extra. I think it was 70% off. So I got some goodies. I got this comforter. Um, it's called the Sunrise Comforter. This was from West Elm. And actually, I don't know. But <laughs> West Elm is a Pottery Barn company or a Willing Sonoma company. So they're all kind of like related. But this one is a really cool like ombre effect i don't even know if it's coming up on camera properly because of all the lighting but it was 98.97 so 70 percent off so it's 30 dollars and it's brand new it's still inside of this packaging so got this inside of here i'm so excited about this because i have been wanting something like this for the uh if you guys have seen the coffee station that i have over there i have a cart like a like a like a bar cart thing and i set up a coffee station over there and I've, I've been looking for like the perfect tray and i think i finally found one it's like a mirrored metal tray that has these lucite handles which i am pretty obsessed with this thing is gorgeous um it was 130 dollars but i believe it was an extra something it's like 50 i think it was like half off around 40 to 50% off. And 
I'm like dead. This is so perfect. I cannot wait to put this over there. If I don't show you in this video how it looks, I'll show you guys in another, but I cannot wait to get it over there um, on the coffee station. But I think I will show you guys how it looks. Um, but, oh, and then in the same bag, I got this beautiful blanket. This is a blanket, right? Yeah, I think it's like a tufted quilt. Okay, yeah, it's a tufted quilt. I don't know if you can see like all the design in there, but it's like tufted, it has like these like decorative little accents. Um, it's super duper soft. It's called the Lunar Diamond Tufted Quilt. And this is in a twin, uh, extra large twin size. So I got the, this as well. We've been just like looking for like new blankets and stuff like around the house. Um, so, I don't know, like, we're just gonna use them for like, random things. Or if we're gonna like, use them for like, to sleep, but... I had to get that, because they were such a good deal. How much is this? Oh, I think the sale price was $150, was like the price, so that was 70% off, so that was like 45 bucks. So that was awesome. Then, oh here, mom really wanted this dog tote bag. And I think they give us this for like 10 bucks. With, that's what, with a discount, because it didn't have a price on it. But it's so cute, the print is adorable. Mom's gonna use this for um, the kids water polo bag. So to carry towels and other stuff for when um, she's dropping them off, or my sister's dropping them off, whoever's dropping them off to use, uh, to carry all their stuff. This one I'm really excited about. This is a, um, a pillow case. And this one is like a Mongolian, Mongolian fur pillowcase, and it is beautiful. Like, look at this. Ugh, luxurious. I cannot wait to get this on the on the sofa. It is so, so, so soft. I love it. I love Mongolian um, sheep fur. So pretty and so soft. So, yeah, I'm really, really excited. Uh, I'm not sure if it's synthetic, it doesn't say on a thing, or if it's real. But I think it's from Potty Barn Teen, which I don't think they have any like real fur stuff, so... But I'm not sure. Correct me if I'm wrong. It's super duper soft though, and I'm really excited about it. And then I also picked up a couple pillows that I think I'm gonna be using for fall. So our fall motif, I think I wanna do like, like pinks and browns and like I wanna work in some orange. So but like by pink, I wanna do like these muted, more cool pinks, right? So this has like a lot of like, like a cool tone pink mauve color, which I think is gorgeous. And this will totally go like with the gray, so I'm I'm happy. I'm so excited. Like it's gonna be so cool. I I don't even know like exactly what I do. I was like letting the pillows kind of like talk to me. So then I found this, which is great because it kind of has all the colors that I want. And this is kind of like the pillow that I'm gonna use to like tie everything in together. Where like for the colors that I want to do in the living room. So we have the pinks. We have the browns. We have like the tan. So, we're gonna bring a lot of that stuff in, but I still wanna keep it like nice, light, and airy. I don't wanna like do anything that's like too intense. And then I got this pillow. This isn't for fall, but I just got it because I really, really like the print. It's really cool. It's embroidered as well as like uh, printed. And I think this is like some sort of technique that they do. I don't know, like with, uh, with the indigo. So, I'm pretty excited about that. Then I got this really pretty, is it Cruel? Cruel, I don't know how to pronounce it, pillow. This is actually like a bed pillow, like for a pillow, but I, I kind of just want to use it like on the sofa, but I don't know, we'll see. I, I just bought it because it was really cheap, like everything, like those ended up only being a few dollars each. And then I got uh, this other pillow cover, which I thought was really pretty. Let's actually open this up so you guys can see it in all its glory. Look at that. This is really pretty. Another just like nice textured, uh, like a beigey, tanny color. And I don't know, like, I think everything that I got kind of like goes together. So I was pretty happy about those. So that is um, pretty much what was inside here. Inside there. The only other thing that was in there was this right here. 
And this is actually a candle that I got. And I got it from my mom because it has the letter V on it and her name is Virginia. And I was, uh, and I was like kind of jealous because they didn't have any of the other letters that I wanted in H. But it smells so good. The scent is frosted pine. And if you guys know about like the Pottery Barn scents, frosted pine comes back every holiday season. It just smells so, so nice. So I can't wait to use this during the holiday season. I'm probably going to wait until like December to start using this because it smells like the pine trees and it smells like so like festive. I cannot. This one was $30. Again, I think it was like 40 or 50% off. So it was like, probably like around 15, 20 dollars, something like that. I also love this paper. I always save anything like that so I can reuse it. It's literally like the best packaging paper. And then, okay, I got this because I am super duper obsessed with this collection from, I think it actually is a William Sonoma home collection piece. Um, this came in a really cool, uh, like a side table. It looked like a giant block of ice on like metal, like metal legs. It was really, really cool. Like it was like sculptural, it was gorgeous, it was so cool. But it was like a gazillion dollars. And then I saw when we were in the store, they had like a, it kind of looked like a cake stand type of thing. And that was also like, Pretty pricey. I kind of wish I got it. Maybe if it's there next time, I might. Like, but then I saw this and it reminded me of the coffee table and I had to get it. And it's so gorgeous. So this is just like a giant piece of like Lucite. And then this was $70. So seven times. So it's probably like around $35 around. Um, and then you can just put the candle on top of it like that. And I just think that looks so so chic, it looks so pretty. So there's the V with a candle. This thing weighs a gazillion pounds though, it is so heavy. But you guys saw like, I, I tried to style it in the store on the tray, I think that looked really nice as well. So I love buying things that have like multi-purposes, so you can use them for so many different things. Um, so you can use this for the candle, you can use this for like a tray of food or whatever. You can use this decoratively, you can place like a decorative object on top of it. I think there's so many cool things you can do with this. Plus it's just so pretty, like I just love just the look of it. Plus it totally goes, as you can see back there, I have a couple Lucite pieces from Jonathan Adler, and I have those Lucite site vases that um those are all thrifted though this full this was not full price but still more expensive nonetheless but i cannot wait for this thing it's so pretty and i can put like so many different candles on top of this as well and just use it like that i wonder if it comes in different sizes i think that'd be really really cool um but i think is that it <gasps> I think that's it. So thank you guys again so much for hanging out with um, a mom and me and um, sh checking out the haul. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Maybe you got some ideas for your own home or maybe you guys want to go check out the Pottery Barn outlet for yourself. I used to do a lot of those videos going to the Pottery Barn outlet and looking for furniture and pieces for the house when we first moved in. But now we pretty much have everything kind of situated. Though we're always changing things up. I'm always changing things up. I love switching at home decor as you guys already know. Fall is here. I want to decorate for fall so that's going to happen. I'm going to change out the pillows and stuff. Of course I'm going to show you guys that too. A lot of you guys have been messaging me. And by a lot I mean like maybe like 10. <laughs> have you guys have been asking about like the home decor stuff and hopefully those videos will be coming up very soon. I do have some, ha um, some Halloween stuff as well coming up. And if you guys have been watching me or following me on Instagram, I've been showing you guys a lot of the fall stuff that we've been doing around the house on Instagram as well. Um, but that is going to be the end of the video. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Tune in tomorrow for a new video at 7am and I'll see you guys all in the next one. Alright, bye!